once upon a time there lived four cows in the forest. They were old friends. Every day they used to graze together. One day a lion saw them. The lion wanted to eat them, so he wanted to catch them. But the old cows fought with him. The lion had to run away. A few days passed. All the cows quarrelled between themselves and started grazing separately. One by one, the lion killed all of them. The moral of the story is. Unity is strength. Thank you. Hi friends, my name is Vijay Vijay. Today I am going to tell you a small story. The name of the story is Big and Small. There were many fishes in the sea. Some were big but most of them were small. The big fishes were real bullies and always struggled the small fishes. One big fish boasted, everyone is afraid of us because we are the biggest and the most powerful. When the small fish stand there, the big fish, the big fish made fun of them. They told them, you are so, you are so tiny. Don't try to fight with us. We are the giants of the sea. You are so big and powerful. You all are not important. One day a fisherman came and he threw a net into the sea. The net was large and strong. The big fishes were caught but the small fish slipped through the holes of the net and remained free. The small fish then laughed and said, Be a small has a lot of advantages. Now you will become a dish for some humans while we will live and be happier in the sea. What use was it to be big and strong when you could not save yourself from the fisherman? Moral of the story, never underestimate anyone. Thank you and have a nice day. My name is Jahana Today I am going to narrate the story, The Bitten Sapling. Once a king went to a scholar and said, I am having everything which a king could desire, but I am not happy because my only son is very spoiled. He is very rude to his elders and cruel to his servants. I have fulfilled his all whims and fancies. But he is very rude to his elders and cruel to his servants. The scholar asked the king to send his son to him. The king readily agreed, hoping for a change in his son's behavior. When the king, uh, when the prince came to meet the uh, old man, the prince asked, Why did you call for me, old man? He didn't reply. He simply said to pluck a leaf from the name sapling and chew it. When the prince chewed it, it was bitter. He pulled out the plant and threw it away and said, we should not allow uh, this plant to grow. When it becomes big, it will be more bitter. The scholar said, uh, Aren't you like the neem sapling? You have uh, many bitterness inside you. When you become a big king, Everybody will hate you and like to remove you. The prince bowed his head and learned his lesson and thanked the scholar for teaching him a lesson. The king also thanked the scholar for imparting wisdom. The moral of the story is the bad qualities Cruelty, rudeness, selfishness may, uh, make you bitterness. It not only in you but in others.